What's up folks, welcome back. We are playing X4. Um, a lot of stuff has happened, as you can see over here. I, uh, I went around, getting some technology. We, we, we don't do, actually, we didn't do that much. It's basically, I've been sitting on my ass just doing these, um, these hacks, getting almost all of the production. We're lacking one, because almost all of the storage was just lacking some of them, uh, one of two of the mediums and the, some of the smalls. Nobody cares about that. We can now do the dockings, we can do the habitation. Eventually, I want to make sure that we um, definitely get everything. Now, I don't want to do everything as a hack, because it just takes too much time. Also, um, teleportation range free. Uh, we need to get more storage up to our HQ. Uh, eventually, getting in all of this stuff. I've never done these, so I'm quite excited about that. Let's talk about the factories that I've built. Uh, we all know the uh, trading station. The trading station uh, is absolutely... It is doing well. Uh, a reason for it is... Let's show more. Is I took out about 22 million. In order to start uh, building the factory over here. Which will produce... Uh, computer substrate and I think we can actually help the Terran uh, protectorate quite a bit now that will go over time all of my factories have been set up um, for my haulers I've decided to use the factory transporter that is in one of the mods um, just set up the uh, the power plant just make sure that you enable energy cells and they will start doing um, uh, the maximum amount because if you do repeat orders you will find that you will at some point your transporters they will just haul like 51 or sell 51 it's so weird it really is weird now, for now let us let's go to the faction rep Start guidance. Ah, there you go. I knew we were very close. We'll um, we'll get our ship. We will go to our cloak ship and we'll head back to to our mission, and and we'll do some stuff over there. So let's go travel mode. Um, Discord, Discord reminder. <laughs> um. Zero is definitely there. Yeah, Zero This is an amazing game. And they are still working on it. Uh, we are expecting version 4.1 shortly. And they there is talk about a new DLC. Now, this is not Paradox. This is um, not as, you know, DLC heavy as, say, EU4 or Hearts of Iron 4. This, um, this game currently has... Ooh. Docking granted. Ooh. Um, yeah, that's true, but I would like to just have it, right? And I will just sell it to whoever wants it. We're not overflowing the market with substance. But, um, yeah. So, what I was talking about was... There is currently three DLCs in this game for this uh, particular version and the X series have been here for a long bloody time and they're absolutely fantastic okay let's get up uh, let me know if the audio is too loud it's an and honor to have you aboard. yeah let's do the ceremony we have to do two of them yeah you can you will Trust me, <laughs> you will. No, you'll grow these little horns and uh, have some fun with that. So the faction representative, we have a lot oh. of missions and the majority of the missions that you can see, like uh, down there, is placing resource satellites. A medical, oh yeah. Me medicine is also you. drugs, right? So let us receive our rank. As a true ally to the Terran Protectorate, Please allow me to present you with this ring. In recognition of your loyalty, you are rewarded with unfettered access to the soul system. 
Of course, this rank comes with benefits beyond that as well. Should you prove to be unworthy of the trust placed in you, these privileges will be revoked. Although, should it come to that, a revoked license would be the least of your worries. I am confident <laughs> that you will find these rewards to be adequate compensation for your effort. You can also expect certain Terran organizations to approach you for your help in the future. Once again, the Terran people thank you for your service. We look forward to your continued assistance. Good luck out there. So, we just got promoted. Can you start a space virus? I don't think so. I don't think so. Maybe in the future. You can eventually do te uh, terraforming. So, I'm definitely interested in, in what we'll go it's around. It's an honor so, to see you here. Uh, the licenses that we still could buy is the trade subscription. Now, I've been told in the past that you can get the trade subscription from hacking. Now, this is false. I've tried. It, 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 um, I believe it, it, it is false because we just have the money. Uh, I saw you. I saw it. It's right in the chat there. You made a clip when like, you're amazing. Um, the trade subscription is different from the ones you're hacking from the station. But indeed, you can get station specific trade subscription. You will never hack all of the stations because there's no point. So save up for 10 million, get this, and you would not get, um, and you would not have to do all of the stations, right? So, <clears throat> yeah, it's not, it, it, it doesn't, unfortunately, it doesn't work like that when I. Well, it was a good suggestion. Uh, we'll get the policing license at some point, but this is more about you when you have your own space, I think. Uh, the issuing faction for this license is, uh, is a police authority. The issuer holds this authority over its own space and its certain, uh, certain cases over space owned by the other faction. In areas of which um, the issuing faction has authority, pilots in possession of this license may freely scan ships. So we could just scan ships, you know, or not. I, I've, I've always bought it, and I've always bought it because of... I was doing auto trading. Auto trading is cool. Dead start time. There is actually a mod that will Good allow you to there. fly the Star Wars ships, which is cool. Yeah, yeah, but I still find it really here. tedious. So the buying of blueprints, and I can show you production-wise, everything in here is scanned. We didn't buy anything. Um, of course, fabrication. I, I don't think I can... Can we get these? Can we, can we hack these? Anyone knows if we can hack these, I would... If we can hack this, then, oh boy. Because that would be bloody amazing. We would, um, oh, that is definitely a shame. Is, uh, is the chat going in? It looks like it, yes. So that is a damn shame because that bloody expensive habitations. We will definitely get these. I'm not going to buy anything for 17 millions. And the defense modules we'll just get as well. So we'll save roughly about, you know, a bunch. Where's my uh, my storage? There you go. So we just lack some of the small and a medium. You know, getting the um, the is the EMP yeah EMP bomb. It, it is um a hundred and thirty thousand. So you will definitely do still do fine. I disagree while on, I'm on the pa Yeah, that, that's actually, it's, it's not, it, it actually is a good idea. If you've, you've, you've referred to it uh, last stream as well. Yeah, it is very smart to do so. Because you will also want to see which ships are where, as well as you, if once you, when you're at war and stuff like that. So ship-wise, I'm looking very much forward to getting like the Bolo and the, um, the gas and the mineral version and the Baldrick. So you can see this is 13 million. Unfortunately, we can't hack that. So Good with all of that there. done, uh, let us let us move to my cloak ship. While we wait for this, these are all ships I've made in preparation. So let's go here. Well, really, I can't reach that. What a joke. Okay, fine. Um. 
teleportu. And then we'll go Entering to our cloak ship. Asteroid belt. I kind of want my cloak ship for this. Why can I not jump over there? It's a Mars. It's real, really, really weird. Huh? Okay, fine. Whatever. Uh, we'll jump to the owl then, if possible. And we'll go find it. Yeah, I think it's an internal storage because it's, it's just clearly not over Entering there. Mars. Okay, so this is our owl, which are repaired. The ships are absolutely amazing. Uh, is my logo on this? Because I noticed that uh, when I'm using this uh, on the laptop, it clearly isn't. <clears throat> let's get my logo back. Thank you. And let's shift D and we'll go for the Katana Cloak. And it, what you can hear now is that, whoop, whoop, is that actually the ship is uh, being moved into an external docking bay. So it takes a bit. Hopefully it will happen fine. Will be available shortly, so let's give it some time. Beggars are operating on this factory. Please do not encourage these professional beggars. If you have any spare credits, please give them to a that registered is so loud. charity. Okay, they can go back. So here we are. Uh, this is our medium katana. katana. Of course, the game finds it really necessary to actually point it out again. And we are unlocking. Now, where we want to go is we want to go over in this direction. Uh, but we'll make a pit stop around... Silicon, no. So, no. Stimulant lab. Yeah, this is where we'll go. So, um, set guidance, autopilot. Uh, we can take it to, uh, let's take a look what's going on over here. So, the docking module is not being built just yet. Let's take a look at the station itself. It's going to take another five minutes. Let's see, what's this? The ship of Plegalian how um, intrinsically modified they are? I have no clue what, the, what that means. Um, and the Moria Yaki fighter makes an excellent satellite ship. Okay, so we do want to make sure that we have some money for that then. Uh, load it to the grills, upgrade our engines and modify them and then zoom. Okay, well it's good to know, thank you. I'm hopefully, hopefully this is going to be going relatively fast. Uh, energy cells will be there, like I said, four minutes, and then um, this construction is getting started. We will need a manager. Now, our managers, by definition, are not the greatest. Not yet, anyway. How's my solar power plant doing? Okay, let's get that money. Because I actually upgraded to a large storage. Currently, I got a lot of these ships just transporting materials. Like uh, one... Uh, not to him. Two, three, four. Okay, that is weird. What are you doing? Energy cells to target. Why are you looking for trade? That makes no sense. Okay, let's set this up again. So, let's continue. Let's we'll go here to behavior. Factory transport. Uh, we do want to add energy cells. We don't have anything back going back to source. Source is going to be the solar power plant. And the target station is going to be the trade station over here. Uh, confirm that. He is waiting for a response. This is likely due to being scanned Entering by 
Asteroid belt. Any police. So let's remove that one. And there you go. He is starting. Who else? I have the, the David. Also doing that. I have the Shadow Slayer. And the Wenhek. All doing... Actually, the Wenhek, it looks like he is not... I can go away. Overwrite that. Yeah, there we go. So they will start just hauling goods. What else do we have? I would like to get a trade subscription actually going. Look at that. We're already back at 10 million. Um, looking over this, we made show less. So in the last... 25 minutes we, we we roughly made six six million once the computer stops race get going that will definitely boost that up i'm hoping like 12 million per hour um it kind of depends it kind of depends uh flying to Bena triumph uh we'll do uh the final hacking we'll build our final factory uh how it is how the level's doing also we need to give him cash do that again HQ there's the money they will start buying it I've assigned I've assigned a miner and a uh, and a trader the other way around um, so they will start um, trading stuff for him he will get the order, he will go to the trade station that is near. You know, there, this is the trade station, he visits this very regularly and, and just gets the stuff needed. Uh, the miner is currently a magpie, it's a Taladi vessel, mining for Naradium by the looks of it. I kind of wish that he would stop doing that, but you know, it's fine. The power plant Entry. he is finally Jupiter. gaining a level. You can see that it's a tiny bit on the third star. It's getting a tiny bit of experience there. Uh, we need level five. Our very first level five. Um, our very first level five uh, manager is going to our power plant. Uh, and the reason for it is because it needs exactly five jumps. Now, the second one who's going to get that is going to be the trade station. And the reason for it is I would like to start building, because we're currently here, another trade station in that certain time. So we'll do uh, one, two, three, four, five. So in here, there will be a second trade station that belongs to us. And we will need... Um, to start hoarding stuff back and forth, back and forth. So a sort of a relay station. But they will most likely... We'll have to see about that. Maybe we need a station that... Hauls the goods from here. And then delivers it to another. So we need a relay station as well. Because if you don't... What your traders are going to do... Just tell me if, if, if you guys are losing me. If you build a second trade station and you assign traders, they will sell goods to the other empires. And we don't want that. They can buy with us, we don't buy to them. So we need a relay station that is just buying and selling stuff from our station to our station. And getting that somewhere in between... Sorry mate. So trade trade stations have orders and currently your station settings are set to allow only my faction now this is done I should close a window I'm seeing mosquitoes here give me a second entering Saturn Sorry for that. Uh, it's not good when you see stuff flying around that 
usually is after your blood. So um, let's let's go back to basics. Um, in your personnel, there is something that's called global orders. Global orders is stuff that happens around your empire, and these are just rules. Say, how will your ship respond to an attack? Well, they will use judgment. They will retaliate. They will escape. They will ignore it. Or they will just sit there and waiting for you to do something. So you'll set all of these up. Then in trade rules, you can say, I want to only accept my empire's goods and only sell to my empire. But you can, of course, change this to get everything done. Uh, blacklist is... I want my ships. I've used this to have an, uh, other empires not dock at my stations, but my ships will sell to those factions. It's it's a lot to take in. I'm I'm, I'm sure it's a lot to take in. Um, but if you get this game, uh, Zero, then uh, you will have a lot of fun playing it. Trust me. Uh, I'll guide you as best to my abilities. Yeah, I know. Uh, even even I'm sounding really confusing to myself. But what you do is this station has no has, has no restrictions. I will sell to everyone that wants it. Going to another station, which is my trade station, I will buy only. This is a buy order. A buy order. I will only buy from my faction, so my personal faction, and I will Entering sell with no Uranus. restriction. So I will sell to anyone who wants it. And you can see how that goes. Uh, let's take a look. Anyone? Yeah, you can see uh, these green, green ships. They're mine. These are my ships from my faction. And these white ones are Terran energy traders who are going to my station, buying stuff from me, giving me cash. Silicon carbide, Terran MREs, only my ship. So this is pure income. Uh, I don't pay anything to produce. And production are all of these. The medical supply factory, micro lanes factory, and all of them have docking, they have storage, and they have production. So you can understand how bloody large this game can be. And we've not even started doing wars. I think, yeah, I've got 300 hours played. I've played 27 hours in the last two weeks. I think this game is roughly 50 hours now. So, there is a lot, a lot to do. And I should stop looking at my chat window. And I should look into here because that is where you are. So, you can see all of that production. Once this one's done, and I think... Yeah, there you can see it's timing down. It's currently building... The docking module. Once we actually have the docking module, we can assign a die, die you damn mosquito. We can assign a manager, and we're going to be assigning all of these ships here, these miners, these gas miners, and we will actually help grow our own station. Now we can also Entering. just do the cedar mode, which just speeds up time, but. Uh, you know, if, if this game is something for you, it might be easier for you to just watch my my YouTube series on this. What's going on over there? Missions. Heavy construction operation. Uh, I don't like fleet missions because I just don't have a fleet. I would like to see build missions. Where I build a station. Should get those laser towers back. And drop them. It's very easy. I'm, I would like to abort the mission for some reason. 
get a one star piloting skill book. So let's go and uh, do ourselves a bit of a spacewalk shortly. Um, I think it's one more jump. One more jump and we're in Bynard's Triumph. Um, we'll probably see the planet where the pioneers have been working on their terraforming. So I'm very excited to see how that goes. Because the pioneers finally have a home planet. Let's take a look here. Okay, so you can see we're now building storage module. And it's going to be solid. The factory is now a large bar. And we are going to be getting ourselves a new manager. Uh, just do it like this. So the largest level here, morale three is really good. Management already won. And it will scale. So we're going to be saying you, you're going to be working somewhere else for me. And we're going to be assigning it to the factory. We're going to be assigning the role manager. And now this person is going to be one of the latest new managers on our facility. Get the information open. Level 1, he will scale up pretty fast. Uh, do I have a book Can I help? pilot seminar? No, Over that's a bit of a shame. Out. I kind of want to go. Uh, I'm going to head off now. We'll probably watch some of the videos. In hey, that's fine, man. Thank you for stopping by and hanging out. I really appreciate it. Let's um, take... This Baldrick. Trade for Commander Alpha. And now all of these ships we're going to be assigning to mine for beta. Let's take a look. What do we have? That is trading. He is trading. The David is trading. A Baldrick. Not a Baldrick. If you want to be uh want to be uh, your own ship, like you want to be named, let me know. I'll name you. Even if you're watching this on YouTube later. Let me know in the comment section and I will do it. Uh, what I want to get going is once we have a level 5. We will assign all of these. All of these to the solar power plant. Maybe even get a large. A large ship in there as well. Okay. So... It looks like that didn't look too good for them. I think that is the station we've stimulus been looking lab. for. Yeah, the stimulants lab. And I, we want to be looking into the planet as well. Autopilot disengaged. I think that is the module we're looking for. Uh, now, before we get started, let's. Um, Can we see the planet? Should be a planet in here. Oh, yep. They, um, they're doing something. I feel like it is um, less red than last time, but I could be completely wrong here. Now, eventually we'll be uh, working with that ourselves. So let's get close to the station and let's get ourselves the last production blueprints and you can see even the AI is building these rings which is habitation so habitat is going to be very important and we also have it looks like a T dock for large ships we can well I don't have enough EPM Otherwise, I would probably get the dock, get the rings. They probably would not like it. We could also get the... Um, is this a small... This is a small one, and I think this is a medium one. You know, they're just almost 10 million, so... Hey. Maintenance vessel. Not anymore. So let's get close. 
Stimulant production. Let's get up. And... Hello. Katana. Let's get into spacesuit. Yeah, I keep confusing myself that it's actually being done from um, the upper angle. Okay, space bot to shoot it. Spacesuit EMP. Now, they might retaliate. Well, not really retaliate. They sometimes say, Hey, you blew something up. And they will start, you know, telling you you're a criminal. So let's go to shift 2, which is scanning mode. And slow down. Slow down. Oh god, I'm really... I hate spacesuit flying. I'll be very honest there. I bloody hate it. That's why I usually do this stuff like... Off camera. Because I bounce literally everywhere. Requesting permission to dock. Okay, a bit closer. Docking permission granted. There you go, decryption. And there we go. We got ourselves the... Uh, the blueprint for the stimulants lab. Now, considering I have teleportation, I can right click, teleport. 17, huh? 17, that's an odd number. I feel like I've missed a ship. Oh yeah, of course, the, uh, the trader in here. Five more minutes and then um, the gas miners, I believe, will start. We already have 10 million. What I like to do, which you don't have to, is... Uh, why am I on my, my suit? Oh, dear. 